All those bright lights along Las Vegas Boulevard, well, the stretch might get even brighter. So you see this little dark spot right here by the Polo Towers along Harmon and Las Vegas Boulevard? This is actually a restaurant and a shuttered strip mall. The owner of the Golden Nugget and the Houston Rockets got the green light to build a resort right here. The fenced off strip mall, former travel lodge and Mexican restaurant at Las Vegas Boulevard in Harmon is all prime real estate and Very owned by Tillman Fertitta from, and Fertitta Entertainment, which boasts an empire of golden nugget properties downtown and nationwide. The Houston Rockets and dozens of restaurant franchises. Clark County gave this plan the green light. Specs for a 43-story luxury hotel and casino. Features include 2,400 rooms with kitchenettes, a 2,500-seat theater, 37,000-square-foot spa and gym, a wedding chapel, 91,000-square-foot convention facilities. For Tita Entertainment's vice president releasing this statement, we were pleased with Clark County Commission's unanimous approval. However, this is just another step in our overall review and planning process. No firm decision has yet been made concerning our future plans. And I don't think it's a part of the strip that we've ever thought of that was going to change. A lot of the thought and effort has been put into the north part of the Strip, the Fountain Blue, Resorts World. It would actually make a lot of sense to put another property there if the Tropicana is going to come out of the market. Dr. Amanda Bellarmino, assistant professor of UNLV's William F. Hera College of Hospitality, explains. This area, surrounded by Allegiant, T-Mobile, Michelob Ultra Arena, and rumors of a possible A stadium where the Tropicana sits, would fill the growing demand for rooms from sports and concert visitors. At this moment, it looks as though there's room for us to grow. Fertitta properties are very well established in other parts of the U.S. So those consumers that have the loyalty points that want to come to Las Vegas, you know, that would be an attraction for them. No word exactly when demolition or construction could actually start on the property. An attorney for the project did tell the county the work will not interrupt Formula One projects or road construction along the resort corridor.